In this video, we're going to be looking at the copious oscillator circuit. So what we've done, uh, and we've, <clears throat> from the previous um, um, common emitter amplifier circuit, we've just added on a few extra components. Um, we've added this tank circuit on here, which is two capacitators in series, and they're in um, parallel with this uh, inductor here, okay? And that's pretty much it, and uh, it works um, really well. Um, what we need to um, to ensure positive feedback, we need um, a phase shift of about three hundred of three hundred and sixty degrees. So, the transistor circuit, um, you know, if we take the output here, whatever the input is, it's going to um, invert it one hundred eighty degrees, and then um, so that provides uh, the first one hundred eighty degrees, and then the tank circuit, which is here, provides the other one hundred eighty degrees. Okay, so um, I run this circuit so. For, this is the uh, the frequency that is, you know, when you do it on paper, you know, you expect to get. So this is the actual frequency that, that we're told um, from looking at the results uh, that Peace Spice gives. So it's it's very much near it, okay. So that's fine. Um, so looking at the uh, simulation settings, um, okay, so that's, the, um, you know, so that they're, they're, that's the simulation settings there. So I don't run the circuit anyway. Um, <clears throat> and we'll see what happens. <clears throat> so this is what we get. It takes time for the oscillations to um to kick in. <clears throat> but once once you do um to do you can see here that you get <clears throat> a really good <clears throat> uh, sinusoidal uh, signal output here. So um to find out what the uh the actual frequency is um we just uh, we measure it here, um, so it's uh, seven point one one six seven kilohertz. Okay, so that's uh, that's what I've written here. Okay, so there you go. So that's a, a very good um, um, oscillator circuit that is uh, is very um, straightforward to build. Okay. So when we come to, when it comes to the Copas oscillator circuit, and these are some of the equations you use. Uh, when you want to find out what the frequency of oscillations um, are at, um, it's 1 over uh, 2 pi the square root of um, L C T. Now L is the inductor value um, and C T is our total capacitance. So when we want to work out what our total capacitance is, in our particular circuit um, it's uh, C2 uh, multiplied by C3 over C2 plus C3. Okay, So that equation comes from when you have two capacitators in series um, you know, this is the equation that you use, okay? And and that's it, okay?